Yo, Jay Blank here. What if someone could make a working copy of your house key just from a quick picture they took of it? Or kick every single one of your devices off your Wi-Fi network with just a push of a button? Well, this little gadget can help do just that. And today, we're looking at two of the Flipper Zero's most notorious apps and the real security holes they expose. The Flipper Zero gets a lot of hype as a pocket size hacking tool, and a few powerful apps are the reason why. We're going to focus on two of them, one that helps you copy physical keys, and another called Wi-Fi Marauder, which can create some serious wireless chaos. But first, a really important disclaimer. This is all for educational and security research purposes. Don't use these tools on any network or device you don't own or have explicit permission to test. Seriously, using this stuff illegally can get you in a world of trouble. Our goal is to show you the vulnerabilities so we can be a little safer. Let's start with the physical world. You probably feel like your house key is pretty secure. As long as no one actually steals the key itself, you're good, right? Well, not as much. The risk isn't just someone stealing your keys, it's someone simply seeing them. There's a community-made app for the Flipper called Key Copier. Now, the Flipper doesn't have a camera, so it can't scan your key from a photo automatically. It's a bit more of a manual, but still pretty cool process. Here's how it works. You take a picture of a key or even just hold the key up to the flipper screen. And then in the app, you select your key brand, like a common arrow or master lock. Then the app shows you an overlay on the screen and you use the up and down arrows to line up the cuts on your key, which are the pointy parts. Each cut corresponds to a number and when you're done, you get a simple code like 34200. That code is basically the blueprint for that specific key. And here's the scary part. With that code, someone can go to a locksmith and get a replica key. This shows just how easily a standard physical lock can be defeated with a little bit of digital help. All right, now for your digital life. The Wi-Fi network you use for everything, it's way more fragile than you think. For this one, they would need a Wi-Fi dev board to the flipper, which opens up a whole new world of wireless tools. We have the Wi-Fi Marauder app, and one of its most powerful features is the deauthentication attack. Let me break that down. Your Wi-Fi router has the ability to tell any of your devices to disconnect. It's not a request, it's like a command and the device has to obey. Normally this is for managing the network, but here's the flaw. That command isn't encrypted. That means any device can pretty much send a fake kick command and your phone or laptop will drop the connection without question. With Wi-Fi Marauder, you scan for nearby networks, pick a target, and they can just launch the attack right away. The flipper starts spamming these deauth packets, telling every device on the network to disconnect over and over and over again. The implication is huge. This isn't just for messing with a gamer. Think about your security cameras, smart locks, or baby monitors. They all depend on Wi-Fi and a deauth attack makes them totally useless, creating a massive blind spot. It's a denial of service attack that fits in your pocket, and it's a big reason why many modern security systems now use 5G with protection frames. If you're finding this useful and want to understand more about this kind of tech works, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's a huge help for the channel and tells me you want to see more stuff like this. So from helping copy physical keys to kicking all your devices off of Wi-Fi, the Flipper Zero is a masterclass in making security exploits accessible. 
The takeaway here isn't that the flipper is the ultimate hacking device. For most of these attacks, dedicated tools can do a better job. The real point is that the flipper makes these attacks easy for anyone to try. Showing that systems we rely on every day are often built on shaky foundations. If a tool you can buy online makes it this simple, imagine what a determined attacker with specialized gear could do. It really shows that understanding the risks is the first step to being more secure. Let me know in the comments what app or feature you want me to break down next. I'm Jay Blanks. Thanks for watching. Peace.